Well, hello everyone, and welcome back to Minecraft. I'm here at the subscriber monument because, um, in case some of you haven't heard, uh, there's been a massive influx in subscribers for the channel. Uh, Athene from Athene Wins, really, really awesome guy, does a lot of cool stuff for the community, uh, did a spotlight on my channel, and uh, we're now sitting pretty at about 670 subscribers, just about. So I'm going to need to go flip this light on. This is the 500 mark, and next milestone is 1,000. Just awesome. awesome. I want to say welcome to everyone who's new to the channel, and I hope you guys enjoy these videos. So I, th I thought I figured today, instead of doing some building like I had planned, I think I'm going to go out and do a tour of things. Uh, I am in version 1.2. Not 1.2. Wow, 1.4. Excuse me. 1.4.2. Wow, it updated today, so it's pretty awesome. I'm very excited about that. And uh, so we're going to kind of go through. I need to make an anvil and repair some things. And I've got a few new things, I want, or at least one new thing I want to show everyone that I've been working on in my own spare time. Alright, so I did a little work over here. This is uh, our castle that we're kind of building bit by bit. As I And I realized as I was building some of it uh, off camera, I ran out of materials. So I had to go and uh, get some more stone, which is why the next thing I'm going to show you guys... Uh, it's, well, not the next thing, but uh, one of the things I'm going to show you guys uh, came into existence. So I got some various rooms. I'm kind of digging things out. And I want to use this cave system as a, kind of a network of corridors for the castle and make it really big. It's going to watch over our wonderful little village over here. Uh, something that some of you guys have been watching the series for a while will uh, remember is remember that lag, like right over here near the the, the smithy where there was that, la that spot where it caused lag. <laughs> it's back, and I don't know why. It just is, and it's just kind of strange. First thing, so uh, I've got a lot of new stuff from just going around gathering materials. So let's go ahead and make an anvil. That was the new thing that came for um that came in this new patch, and apparently you can use it to you can use like regular diamonds to repair tools and so I want to actually see how much it's going to cost me to combine some tools together that's not what I need I need diamonds this is the storage house by the way this was built just to kind of keep things. I've got a lot of diamonds so we're going to get a whole bunch of those and um, need some iron too so let's go ahead and get some iron blocks and go in there and some iron right here all right so this should this is not enough <laughs> I need more iron blocks it's a really, really expensive uh, crafting recipe, so let's hope I can remember how to do this correctly. I think it's either, it's either this with one in the middle and then that. Okay, that's not it. So it's the opposite way. Okay, I'm going to need a whole heck of a lot more iron blocks. I need... Actually, I just need one more. Please be the right recipe. That's not it either. Okay, hang on, guys. I will be right back after I figure... Actually, you know what? Let's just, we're just going to experiment. And maybe if we switch this. I should have looked this up. Oh, there we go. There we go. That's it. All right. Anvil. That's what we wanted. Let's go ahead and put all this metal back, at least all the iron. That can go there, and that's going to go back in that stack. And, okay. So we need a place to put this. Um... You know what? Oh, and I apologize if you hear cars going by. I, I live near a uh, big major highway, so I'm not sure if you'll be able to hear it or not because I have a pretty good microphone, but we'll have to see. Uh, I think it needs to go in the... We'll go and continue the tour, and I can repair it in a little bit. So we'll head over here. This is Reginald. He's my dog. He's pretty awesome. Hi, Reginald. He sits here a lot. He's the guard dog. No, no, you sit back down. You're not going anywhere. Go ahead and take our nether portal. This is a, you're kind of a network of portals that I've set up. They go all over the map into various different places, and I only really use two of them. The the one that gets here, this is kind of our another kind of hub that gets here. I need to watch out for gas, so I don't have my bow on me. Um, let's use the sword. Trying to see if we can't get uh, over to our other. We have a couple more portals to get to. Um, but we will leave those alone for now. There's actually another fortress that goes all the way down through there. Blaze farm, or not Blaze farm, but Blaze spawners and everything. We ended up with a fairly good nether spawn, and so I've actually got these glowstone blocks that are taking us to our other portal. I swear they nerfed that. Um, I won't go over a full, uh, just a side note, I'm not going to go over a full overview of what new features we have in 1.4.2. Uh, simply because, one, I don't know all the new features, and two, because I kind of want to learn them myself. So this is, this is our um, little mining facility. Um, I'm back there is what I'm going to show you guys uh, that I've been working on. So mainly it's kind of uh, trying to make it look a little nice to choose this area to test out some patterns for possible houses. And there's a ton of obsidian and stuff here. We're just kind of mine that out and various ravine stuff. 
Oh, man, I gotta turn this a fan on. My computer's starting to overheat. All right, so we'll head back in here and uh, show you guys what I've been working on. You know, I decided that we need a strip mine because I needed some a lot of cobblestone. So basically, I've taken this and I've done three rows already. And every place it's mined out, there was some sort of ore there. I ended up getting enough levels to enchant a silk touch pickaxe too, which is awesome. And now I won't have to mine uh, cobblestone. I can mine smooth stone. And this actually goes really, really far in and in here. It's another one over here. It goes way down there. So, uh, we'll go ahead and leave this be for now. Dang it. Oh, man. I'm so used to being, I've been on peaceful mode for a while, just playing around, testing stuff out. And it's just been, ah, oh, and then my, my stamina goes down now, and it's just bothering me. Bothering the crap out of me. And I got plenty of food. It's just I have to eat every, like, every second, because I like having a full bar. And, oh, I'm still getting iron. All right, so I think we need to put the anvil down in here. Bam. Okay, that makes a really cool sound. All right, I want to see what it's going to cost me to combine this with this. 39. 39. Okay, can I repair you? I can, but it's going to cost me 18 levels. Okay, I think a better idea would be to take these sticks and make a new diamond pickaxe. <laughs> And uh, we'll simply repair this later when we have the le number of levels. So I'll have to go mine up stuff normally uh, for now. Okay, we're going to continue the tour. Let's get the whatever iron is forged. And now we have a couple of chests full of things here. There's items found and dug up during the, that I haven't bothered to move to the surface. Tons of cobble that uh, is supposed to, that normally I have cooking in furnaces, but I don't have it right now. Gold. And wrong one. You go in here. All right, so let's head out. But actually, do I really have any place else to show? Um, oh, yes, yes, I do. I have the mob, the mob spawner, the mob farm. It's broken because spawning doesn't work the way it used to when I made it. And uh, yeah, so actually, we'll head out. So we have a kind of area we started. I started to build something, but it didn't really. Well, I kind of lost interest in building that, and I'll probably go back to it at some point and kind of see more of the Nether Fortress there. And kind of see, I don't have too terribly much built in this uh, in this map. So uh, we'll have to, I'll be taking ideas from you guys. Well, not taking really. You guys feel free to give ideas and suggestions and things you'd like to see built as we go through. And this is kind of our nicer. I think it's over here. Yeah, it's the it's along the beach over here. Kind of have to cross the river and go down there. There's some there's a tower I've built. It doesn't want to load in. Uh, yeah, yeah. I'm too lazy to walk all the way over there. So uh, we're gonna get back to actually doing some building projects today. All right, man. I spent eight minutes on, this on that uh, tour. All right. Uh, something I don't like is that the um, portal immediately activates again. That seems to be a bug is that, uh, in this version. Like normally, you'd come out and it wouldn't. You wouldn't be able to like immediately go back to the portal just by standing there. Okay. So I'm looking forward to seeing the new mob. Uh, there's new bats that are that have come out. Also, villagers can be infected by zombies. So I got to be really careful of that. Um, we don't need to go there. We need to go back to the house. That's a ghast. Oh, God. Run. And let's get the heck out of here. And down. Yeah, so the goal is kind of, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to combine that silk touch. Oh, God. Oh, no. This is one of the new mobs, too. It's, a. Uh, This is a um, one of the uh, God. What is it called? Crap! It's a uh, a wither skeleton, and they hit like a truck apparently. So let's let's use some of these blocks and see if we can't lock him in there. Oh God! Did you drop the? I don't know if he dropped it. Okay, let's see, because they can drop uh, the, he the the wither skulls that we that are needed to summon the wither boss. And that'll be a boss we're gonna fight at some point too. But it's supposed to be really, really abominably strong. Oh, it looks like it just dropped a bunch of bones, so I'll have to watch for that. I totally forgot about those guys. Yeah, there's a new boss, which is kind of awesome. Let's just warp back through here. We'll eat some, or maybe we won't eat some tasty melons. It is nighttime, so we'll need to watch out for zombies. I've got this place well lit, though, so we should be fine. 
All right. We don't need that. Let's go and ga grab all of uh, the stone that I put back in this chest recently. And we're going to make a bunch of stone bricks with that. So, okay, so the plan today is we're gonna kinda, I'm going to try to continue. I need some more logs, actually. We're going to try to continue uh, working on the castle and see if we can't do some more with that. I need, actually, yeah, half a stack of those. We'll get half a stack of, or almost half a stack of spruce logs. And uh, maybe if the 14 of these so we can do something with that. Might be able to use the the light uh, wood planks as a nice accent to the castle. All right, so we're gonna head back over there. I need to make a really big road that goes around here. So I think we'll do that last though, because it doesn't really feel necessary to do it now. Oh god, this is that's a zombie villager. Hang on, let's go, let's go look at this. So there is a way to cure these guys and turn them back into regular villagers, but that's a zombie villager right there. And it means it's a villager that got infected by a zombie, like it was killed by a zombie, and that's what they turn into, which is kind of sad, actually. It means one of my villagers either got infected in there, or zombies got out, or zombies got like, or got out and ran around. Spider. Yeah, I should probably see. Let's actually, you know what? what enchant? I don't even know what enchantments on this sword. Looting. Oh, looting one. No wonder I got so many um, bones from that uh, wither skeleton. Yep. No, you don't. Die, zombies. Murder! I will... Whoa, whoa, what the heck was that? A potato? That's new. I wonder how I get... Ca I'm kind of wondering how I get carrots, actually. Because can, you can make carrots on sticks and actually dr uh, drive pigs around. So if anyone knows the answer to that, uh, kindly let me know cause in the comments below. Because I would actually like to be able to make a uh, carrot on a stick and uh, drive a pig around. Like my own personal mount. I will actually be willing to go in and, and redesign the texture pack so that pigs look like epic mounts instead of instead of regular pigs. Uh, so that I can have something cool to ride around on. Alright, so I got to... I'm one of... One of my, blah, excuse me. What the plan is right now is to kind of map out where I want these rooms to be. I want this to be more like... Uh, I should get rid of... Chris is actually running out of room. Because I have all that nether stuff in there. Okay. Do that and put that in there. And then we want this to come out and cut back. I don't want to take too much of this out, but I definitely want to remove some of this stuff so I can change it. Oh, spiders. Spiders. Die, spider. Oh, the advantage of having armor. I should probably have put my diamonds up, but that's only ha like half of them, so I guess it'll be okay. Lo and behold, it was and everything was not okay, and he died and lost all his diamonds. All right, so we're gonna fill this in with these stone bricks. We will need something. To, we'll need some slabs to go here. So let's go. And oh, there it is. Okay, so again, I didn't bring the crafting bench with me, so that I did. Here we go. So let's. All right, so we'll leave those seeds there. I don't need those. I don't need this bucket of water right now either. But we can go ahead and put some steps in. Like that. Like that. Yeah, that already looks nice. You're, you're kidding. How many bloody monsters are there? Good lord. I also swear they changed the skeleton sound when they get hit. And that's probably in the patch notes, and I should have... Swear I there's someone firing. Oh, son of a gun. And he dropped a bow, which could very well be enchanted. Let's see. Nope, it's a nearly broken bow. <laughs> Forgot they, they can actually drop items that have uh, damage values on them now. Which is just the slightest bit stupid. Uh, let me check my option, make sure I have my, uh, my okay, my brightness is all the way up. We're good to go. Wanted to make sure you guys can actually see everything that I'm doing. As opposed to uh, not being able to see everything that I'm doing. So we'll do it that, and then we'll bring this around. Yeah, I kind of I like the dimensions for the room like that. That looks nice. Kind of have an open art. Kind of have an open doorway here. I want to take this. I'm getting shot at, aren't I? 
Who the heck? Oh. Son of a gun. <sighs> okay. Back to what we were doing. I'll build that up like that. Oh. Uh, on the bright side, I have a Silk Touch pickaxe now, so... I never have to waste another piece like that. And this should actually be this block. So that comes up nicely and, and matches this here, and this will be kind of an open gateway. So, I'm actually going to need to be wrapping this up pretty soon, sadly, as I can't let the episode run too long, or otherwise it'll take literally decades to upload. <laughs> I have, like, the worst internet right now. I used to have really nice internet, and now, uh, since I moved here, the internet's been really bad. But we're looking to upgrade it, as I've let some people know already. And yeah, so I kind of like, oh my god, it's just like a skeleton slaying fest. It's just, it's just slaughter skeletons, and uh, maybe we'll get something done. <laughs> All right, and then I want this to go around, and I want this to be a wall here, but I want it to open up into a room that's like right on the other side. So let's just go ahead, and we will do this. We'll clear out this area. We'll need to go one one deeper though for the floor, but for now I just want to kind of clear it out. And then uh, I think we'll go ahead and call the episode quits for now. Uh, after we kill this creeper, of course. And boop. And you dead, son. Okay, we'll kill a few more monsters. Still takes four hits to kill a zombie, though. I need a better sword. This looting one is not nearly good enough. So I think in my spare time I will go ahead and do some more mining in the strip mine. Level up some. And then we'll be good to go for uh, having whatever we need. So um, I guess today we'll we'll end the, the episode here. We'll go ahead and take our screenshot of the uh, for our, our thumbnail we, of the Victory Monument being more lit up than it was before, and we have that. All right, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, don't forget to like and subscribe. Once again, welcome to all the new subscribers. It's good to see you here. Thanks for coming by and thanks for sticking around. And uh, once again, hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, don't forget to like and subscribe. And uh, thank you once again for watching. It really means a lot. And this is Gravion signing out.